This local sports report is presented by Howie Schmidt Realty, a proud supporter of the Air Centennials. Howie Schmidt Realty has been helping local families buy and sell homes since 1981. They bring experience, local knowledge, plus a friendly and caring approach to help you purchase your dream home or get the best price when selling. Contact Howie Schmidt Realty today at 519 6 6-6-6-6, or visit hsrealty.ca. Family Day Monday action in the GOJHL from the NDCC as the Air Centennials getting set to play host to the Caledon Bombers. Let's hop right into the first period of this one, and it takes a whole 43 seconds for the Sens to strike. Out front, bobbling puck out front. Blake Kersey bangs away at it. He gets the last touch on it, and the Sens have an early 1-0 lead just 40 seconds into this hockey game. Still in the first period, and about six minutes later, Air looking to add to the lead. Zach Lewis makes his way in on the near side. He picks the five hole. Lewis has number nine on the season, and the Sens are out to a hot start. It's 2-0 Air, but Kaladin would respond. Ryan Tackaberry up top. He floats one home. Tackaberry has number eight on the season, and Kaladin has cut the lead in half. It's a 2-1 hockey game. Then Bombers now looking to tie before the end of the first frame. Ryan Tackaberry double dips in the first period. He's got his second of the game. His second of the period ties us at two after 20. To the second frame we go. Sends looking to retake the lead. Great passing play back up top. Nathan McCaddy, his first junior goal with the Air Centennials. It's a big one as it's put them up three to two. That's where we would stand after 40 to the third period and a bad turnover in behind the goal. Jack Weezer, a gift. He tucks it in as the Air Centennials double up. It's 4-2 air and they would keep pressing in the third frame. Owen Parsons out front, he buries it. Parsons, his team leading 26th on the campaign. Air makes it 5-2 with some big insurance, but they would keep their foot on the gas in the third frame. Ethan Stover up top of the side of the goal. He taps it in. Stover makes it 6-2 air late stages of the third period, and that would be plenty for the Sens on a family day Monday. They take it final 6-2 over Kaladin. It uh, feels good. It uh, feels good to close off the series and series, keep the uh, keep the streak rolling, and uh, um, keep buzzing going into playoffs. The boys are going, um, so you know it's it's easy to get up, but we try to keep it um, pretty like pretty median, just to uh, stay like we don't want to get too high. I think that was our biggest problem, and so I mean we just got to keep going and uh, hopefully keep the streak alive.